Local mayors are banding together, asking the city of Cincinnati to relocate its shooting range. Leaders in Woodlawn, Lachlan and Lincoln Heights call it a nuisance for their residents. Not on your sides. Mariel Carbone is live in Woodlawn to explain the reason why they moved it. Mariel. Well, Kristen, just behind these homes sits the Cincinnati shooting range. And in just a few hours, we were out here. You could hear officers practicing all day. Now, some of the residents who live in this area say that you get used to that sound, but others have called it disruptive and startling. The noise has became like a war zone. This is the sound neighbors here in Woodlawn hear day in and day out. Bullets flying at the city of Cincinnati's shooting range. Morning, noon, night, it has gotten to be too much. That's so why Lincoln Heights Mayor Ruby Mumphrey, along with others in the surrounding area, out. penned this letter to city council asking for the range to be moved. Mumphrey says it's not only bad for families who live nearby, but also for business. And our children have gotten immune to it. We're trying to develop the village of Lincoln Heights. We're on an uphill climb. We're getting our streets done. But we do recognize that in order to continue to prosper, the shooting range needs to go. The range has been located in Evendale for 70 years and it's used to train Cincinnati police officers. Obviously our police officers need a place uh, to train, to retrain. Council member David Mann says it's not the first time the issue has come up, but he says there aren't many open spaces to move the range. So the question is, are there alternatives that we could look at and that would uh, have less impact on surrounding uh, communities and citizens. He's open to discussion. Meanwhile, Mumphrey is asking the council to come out for a visit. And let them be able to experience the sounds uh, that our residents have to uh, endure. And Mayor Mumphrey says that she is waiting to hear back from the city of Cincinnati about a date when her and some of those other local leaders here in this area can sit down and discuss the issue. Reporting live in Woodlawn, Marielle Carbone, 9 on your side.